So fades the great harvest of my betrayer. Time was your ally, human, but now it has abandoned you. As much as 343 Industries seems to divide the community, I think we can all agree that the Didact and mostly the Prometheans were a fantastic addition to the Halo lore. I know they'd existed a long time as concepts before 343, but the company really brought them to life. And here we've got the Didact, Watcher, and Crawler, but these are not the ones we're reviewing today. Hello once again, YouTube, and welcome back to The Domain. We've got, oh, this Halo Hero Series 10 Didact is one of my favorite all-time figures. He's got beautiful paint apps all over his body, and then these two are just basic Watchers and Crawlers. But I just wanted to start the video with these guys so you could sort of, it sort of builds it up to what we are getting ourselves into today. Now, this is also a video that I've probably prolonged for the longest time of any video because I received these customs oh, I don't even know six months ago now the figures I'm about to show you are from that 70s dude and his hobbies who is now miniature hobbyist now I sent him a set of Prometheans not the series 10 didact but the broadsword didact along with a watcher and crawler and I set him the challenge of making some beautiful customs and he 100% delivered and to show you these customs we want to switch to our macro lens because I want to get up close and personal with these figures Okay, here we go. So I set that 70s dude with the challenge of making some special Prometheans in a kind of mithril silver color scheme. And I think he delivered so well. We're gonna start with the crawler to begin with. Here we go. Look at this thing. Wow, it's so cool. It reflects light amazingly. So this is the crawler in this very sort of ancient or sort of godlike silver. And then he also comes with his buddy, the Watcher as well. So that 70s dude really exceeded expectations with these, just created these beautiful silver figures and they really stand out. They are awesome. And I actually gave a couple of these away in my haul video that I released about a month ago now. So I guess if you'd watch that whole video you know what's coming you've not seen them this close up and they've also got this gorgeous orange highlighting he sort of extended the original orange which is more just like an eyepiece and he's pulled it all the way through the eye sort of socket or the the uh, indent and then he's just added it everywhere a couple of extra pieces really elements that should be extenuated with that orange so he's done just a spot on job here and then some great little dark brushings all over this silver i can't get enough of it it really just reflects so nicely. So there's our Watcher and our Crawler, and I was very, very pleased with these. He did an amazing job, Miniature Hobbyist, and guys, if you have not subscribed to his channel already, go check him out. He's a really good guy, and he does some amazing Warhammer tutorials, lots of miniature figures. So that's the Watcher and the Crawler, but they've got to be led by someone, and it ain't just any old Promethean. This is the Didact. Whoa, he's too tall for the camera. There we go. There's the Didact. Whoa. So cool. Such a great use of a didact. I've actually got quite a lot of didacts hanging around. I used to buy them up a lot. I knew they would be rare one day. And look at that. I can actually, I'm looking at way more detailings that I didn't even realize was on the original figure. Like, I guess you can't, I, I guess if you looked hard enough, you'd be able to tell. But the silver really brings out these sort of like pipelines. I wouldn't notice those, but you can see them very well here. You can also kind of see a watcher in his back. I don't know, it kind of looks like that. The didact is just such a legendary character. He died way too early in Halo 4, if you ask me. The problem with 343 is they sort of, like, resolve their stories, like, too early. Like, I don't know, I, I guess Halo 5 is not the case, but maybe it is because they seem to be just ignoring Halo 5 as they're going into Halo Infinite. But at the end of Halo 4, everything was resolved. Like, the Didact should have got away, and then Halo 5 was sort of chasing after him, and then maybe finding out that he'd buddied up with Cortana, or maybe Cortana destroys him. Ah, it also, he looks like he's got a real skull on his head. Ah, oh, this is fantastic. I love this so much. And this is just another quick short video, guys. I've been doing quite a few short videos, and really, honestly, I just wanted to take a little bit of a break after the Christmas Toymation Fest, but I wanted to keep you going with some content, so I'm releasing smaller, smaller videos, you know? But we do have a big video coming on Sunday. That evening, you can join me as I build my first diorama in Hong Kong, a huge banished diorama that includes all my figures and vehicles. It's gonna be a great stream, so I really hope to see you guys then, and I hope you've also been just supporting my other smaller videos. I released a Halo Hero Series 12 and 13 diorama battle. It was filmed by Bam Bam Productions, the 
absolute legend that is that guy. He's, he's so cool. And really just, it's, it's up and up for 2021 with the domain. Thank you very much for tuning in today and let me know what you think of these figures down below. And also let me know what your favorite part of Halo 4 was. What do you think is the defining moment of Halo 4 or what do you think they did best? Halo 5 has some, some serious issues, but Halo 4, I mean, as a starting game for 343, I thought it was fantastic. Amazing campaign, beautiful multiplayer, like I, I loved Halo 4 at the time. So let me know in the comments, what is your favorite part of Halo 4? And as always, have an amazing day out there. The Watcher, whoa, is si oh, okay, where did he go? All right, the Didact signing off. The Watcher flew away. Didact signing off. Whoa. The Formers have returned. This tomb is now yours. You persist too long after your own defeat. Come then, warrior. Have your resolution.